Hey, <coughs> fuck. <coughs> Hey team, Carl here, Red Bean Recipes. Today, I'm just going to walk you through a dish that I cook quite a lot at home. A um, bit of a ketogenic dish, um, and it's pretty good for after training. So I hope you like it. Like and subscribe. Let's get you started. <laughs> really? <laughs> can you feel the tension in the air right now? I know I can. I can feel it all the way down in my plums. Okay, to start off, portion up some salmon i did cut this and season it with chili black pepper and salt prior but forgot to turn the camera on hey fellas who's the goose <laughs> next up get a pan of water on the boil for your pasta oil up a frying pan pop your salmon fillets in skin side down in the meantime you can get some dill chopped Flip your salmon if needed. Also, you can push down if you want the skin to get crispier. Take them off and let them rest on the side. I'm using edamame pasta. You can use any pasta you like, but I'll prefer this just for the low carb content. And I quite enjoy the flavor. Pop them on to boil. Hey you, what are you doing? I like to watch. I want to watch you boil. I can't do it with you watching. The sauce is going to use 300 ml of thickened cream, a heap of teaspoon of whole grain mustard, and a heap of teaspoon of Dijon mustard, and give it a good stir. I'm going to turn that down. Salt and pepper to taste. Add a quarter teaspoon of garlic powder. Then add half a tablespoon of mixed herbs and give it a stir. Give it a taste. Nice. Next, we're gonna strain our pasta. Pop that into the sauce and give it a good mix around. Add your chopped dill. And we're good to serve. All right, thanks for watching, guys. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. And give it a good splash of that. Uh, good bit of. Give it. <laughs> tough time never lasts. Only tough people last. <laughs>